In this video, I'm going to be showing you three basic and very, very easy food farms for your Minecraft survival. So without any further ado, let's get right into this video. So there are three food farms that I recommend you build in your survival world and each of them has their own advantages. So make sure you smack that like button and subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to hit 50,000 subscribers by the end of this year and it will not be possible without you guys. Because here you can see in my friend, you will see three different types of farms. We're going to be building every single one of the farms and all the timestamps are in the description a sub would really really be appreciated so now i'm going to be showing you the first one over here is the fish farm now this farm is personally my favorite because it not only gives you food it also gives you a lot of ton a lot of different amount of loot as well and then the next one over here is a cow farm it's going to give you of course cooked cooked beef and of course some leather as well this one is really really powerful and really really good as well and the next one is going to be of course the chicken over here which is going to give you a lot of cooked chicken now these both farms will give you cooked food as soon as they get dropped but the fish farm will only give you fish but not cooked fish because it's literally a fish farm and it's going to be fully automatic as well so like i said before each of these farms have their own advantages and disadvantages the advantages of both of these farms is that they just instantly get cooked food you don't have to cook it but then for the fish farm the fishes are not cooked because it's from water but the fish farm is my most favorite is because it is completely afk and automatic you can leave it afk so those are the three farms now let's start with the fish farm itself so i'm gonna grab a fishing rod and of course i'm gonna grab an anvil where you need to get the lure enchantment if you don't have lure enchantment it's fine if you don't have any enchantment it's also fine but to improve the farm you can use enchantments and of course the luck of the sea as well if you use both of these you're gonna get a lot and a lot of loot apart from the fishes and the food that you get so i'm gonna enchant these one by one and there we go once we have the most op fishing rod over here also you don't have to worry about your fishing rod losing durability with this farm your fishing rod will never lose durability even if you don't have mending so you do not have to worry about it at all now how this farm works is that you're gonna go ahead and what are you gonna do is you're gonna afk exactly at this spot over here walk in the front like this you want to make sure you point your cursor over over here exactly on top of the signboard and you want to right click once once you right click you'll see that the fishing rod will fetch do that and then it will automatically pull back and all the loot will go down into the chest below our farm let's wait for it and bam as you can see you just got some xp as well and also some loot let's go down and check let me show you guys there's a chest over here and there's a minecart with hopper below the lava and bam we just have a one raw salmon so i'm gonna go ahead and stand over here again and then just point it like that and fetch and let's wait for it and there you go so now you might ask how is it completely afk and automatic now we did a separate video for this fish farm it's an what the f okay we are back with the face cam sorry about that anyways so now uh what where was i yeah you guys might ask how this is completely afk and automatic and now i did a separate video for this fish farm it's an amazing xp farm as well you can afk over the night make sure you go ahead and check that video out link in description you're gonna have to go ahead and use an auto clicker to go ahead and make this farm completely afk or automatic so that is the fish farm and we're gonna be starting to build this fish farm in this chest i have all the materials you need in exact amounts go ahead and grab these materials and let's start building now building this fish farm is going to be very very easy all you have to do is start by going ahead and placing one two three four five six and seven and then you're going to go ahead and place some slabs on top of it like this and then you want to go ahead and place it just over here and grab your two signboards that you have place a sign board over here and make sure you do what the signboard says which is a uh, su su subscribe guys subscribe it says subscribe make sure you subscribe or else the farm will not work it will work but yeah whatever just subscribe guys do I, do I have to say it every single episode oh my god so the next step is you want to go ahead and grab a water bucket and place a water bucket exactly on the chest and behind the chest as well just like that now go ahead and grab a bucket of fish any fish and then go ahead and drop the fish over here this will uh, tell minecraft that this is a pond or a lake so you can start fishing so now once you're done with that you're gonna go ahead and place a block on top of the chest and then go ahead and place a slab right in front of the chest why we have a slab over here is to make sure that we don't fall in the lava over here how much ever you try you're not gonna fall in the lava so once you have this ready what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna go ahead and break some blocks one two three and four and go down by four blocks one you want to break make sure you go down by four blocks as well now once you're done with that you're gonna go ahead and grab your chest and place the chest over here exactly grab your hopper place the hopper going to the chest 
and now we're gonna go ahead and grab a glass block place two glass block over here gonna grab your signboard over here and then go ahead and place a signboard on top of the hopper exactly like that and then go ahead and grab your rails two rails over here and your minecart with hopper go ahead and give it a little bit of push make sure it goes inside and now we can go ahead and remove these blocks over here make sure you have a glass block over here so that you can open this up and also to make sure that the minecart does not move anywhere else now we're gonna place uh, another block over here place a staircase over here and a slab over here. this is to go ahead and stand now place your lava exactly on the second block from here not the first block the second block right over there you're actually done with the entire farm now all you gotta do is grab your any fishing rod now stand here and then bam we have the farm successfully ready and great my face cam keeps dying for some reason Ooh. all right so the next farm is of course the cow farm the beef cooked beef now how this farm works is that it's gonna be very easy for this farm you're gonna be needing some wheat and all you have to do is go ahead and climb on top over here and just go ahead and feed these guys over here just like this and once you feed these guys when they have babies the babies will be taken down as you can see they'll be taken down over here down uh, with the water over there and once they are taken down over here you just need to wait for them to grow up you could switch this lever on you'll see lava flowing with these two layers over here and you can switch that back off and you will have cooked beef and leather now now this lava will not affect these children over here these poor babies of course because the height of the lava is over there and we have some signboards behind these cows as you can see so now to build this farm the materials you need are in this chest go ahead and grab these materials and let's start building this farm start off by placing some blocks over here some blocks like this now we're gonna go ahead and add a dispenser over here add a block and of course add a button to grip the dispenser and now you're gonna add a lava bucket i which i forgot great you can add a lava bucket in the dispenser and now add your signboards over here one over here and another one over there and of course like the fish farm the signboard is gonna say something and make sure you follow it make sure you subscribe oh my god so okay the next one is gonna of course build some uh, walls over here we're gonna break these blocks over here break these two blocks as well chests a double chest and of course go down and place hoppers going inside the chest and now you can go ahead and place your glass blocks on top add another layer on top exactly like that and now what you're going to be doing is you want to go ahead and place some more glass blocks and some more blocks on the top like this now once you place some blocks over here you're going to place two buttons over there and you're going to extend here just like this two four more blocks now let's make a border once you have this border you're going to increase the size of this border by at least three more layers that's two and that's going to be and now what you're going to do is you want to go ahead and add two blocks over here and another two blocks over there now i like to add glasses over here so i know what is happening just like that and now of course you can add glasses over here as well i promise you the face cam will not die right now okay from now the face cam won't die anyhow for decoration purposes you can add some slabs on the top over here i want to go ahead and go down over here add two water blocks filled whatever and now the water will stop exactly there and now what you're gonna do is you want to go ahead and get some cows inside this farm you could use wheat to attract cows to this farm and once you got inside some cows all you gotta do is just feed them with wheat and there you go buddies and of course as they make babies as you can see the babies will yep they'll get caught down over here and you just need to wait until they grow and you can need to fix switch this on so as you can see some of them have grown up and some of them have not grown up let me switch this on let's see uh we have six cooked beef i'm gonna switch this on and as you can see the cows that have grown up are going to of course die and then we're gonna switch that off once again and as you can see whoa whoa we just got 10 wow now that's exactly how you build the second farm the cow farm now let's move on to the last and the final farm the chicken farm now this chicken farm is also automatic and completely afkable because we're not going to be using these baby chickens we're going to be using their eggs to actually uh let's see oh as you can see over here we have some chickens over here we're going to be using a dispenser which is behind over here which is going to be throwing eggs as these uh chicky as these chickens lay some eggs 
it's gonna go inside this dispenser and the dispenser is gonna throw that egg after they grow up their cooked chicken is gonna fall inside so that's how basic it is it's, it's very easy it is one step better than the cow farm because you don't have to do anything it'll automatically do everything by itself so the materials needed to build this farm is in this chest let's go ahead and so these are the materials you need to build this chicken farm go ahead and grab these now to build this farm we're gonna start with the collection system and then build it slowly oh my god chill dude chill look at that so what are you gonna do is you want to go ahead and lay a chest this is gonna be our collection system and of course and a hopper over there once you place a hopper you're gonna place a temporary block over here and add a dispenser facing the front remove that temporary block and add a slab in front of the dispenser this will prevent the lava from flowing downwards because we're gonna have lava on top of this slab now grab your trapdoors and place trapdoors over here one and another one and close it up and another two slabs over here one two close these up as well place a glass block over here and another trapdoor over here and open that up now once you have that you're gonna go ahead and grab more of your glass blocks and place a glass over this glass block about the dispenser and your lava on this trapdoor now what you're gonna do is you wanna go ahead and connect a hopper to the dispenser and then we're gonna have chickens on this layer all you have to do is go ahead and place a temporary block over here and surround some blocks outside and add a slab or else they will just jump outside you can add another slab over here as well now we just go ahead and grab some chickens and bring them inside this farm now let's go ahead and grab some chickens let's put them inside so it's better you bring in as many as chickens as possible now if you can't get in more chickens all you gotta do is bring two chickens and then give them seed they'll start breeding and those babies will grow up so now once you're done with that all you gotta do you can close this up or you can keep it open it's completely up to you and now we're gonna have to do the redstone part it's gonna be a very simple easy redstone one observer two redstone dust and one hopper can you guys shut up god now what you're gonna do is you want to go ahead and where is my oh, there it is you're gonna break a block over here below let's break some more blocks and we're gonna go down and we're gonna be placing we're gonna be placing a temporary block over here and in observer over there and now remove no 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 so the face should be upwards over here now grab a comparator and place a comparator on the observer now you want to go ahead and add a redstone dust before that add a block and add a redstone dust over there and of course you can close over here you don't need this it's gonna go exactly over here and add a block over there now you are completely done with the entire farm as soon as there's an egg inside the dispenser it will dispense out and the chicken will get cooked once they grow up and then of course you have cooked chicken you could add other blocks on the side and just close it up like i did over here as you can see and that is your chicken farm those are the three most essential food farms you go ahead and choose any of it i recommend fish farm first and then of course the chicken farm next and the cow farm the last when you're done watching and you don't know what to watch next make sure you check out my minecraft survival episodes link in description or in the end screen